Guys, today is the day that we've all been waiting for, which is the listing of our beloved Pixelverse. Yesterday, NotCoin on their official Twitter handle congratulates Pixelverse on their listing that's happening today, and also announced their partnership. But then, there are some very important things you've got to do right now so that you can be eligible for Pixelverse airdrop allocation today. Guys, I feel the need to tell you this. So, recently Pixelverse made me one of their ambassador. I'm telling you this because, as a Pixelverse ambassador, I receive info directly from Pixelverse, unlike other YouTubers who just make research based on what they see online. Therefore, whatever information I give you in regards to Pixelverse, you should know that it's a very genuine one. So, one of what you've got to do is to connect to your Bybit Web 3 wallet. I know some of you will be like, you've done that already, but this time around, you have to do it on desktop computer, and it can be a little bit tricky. In this video, I will explain it to you in a very simple way, right? You're going to be needing a laptop to get this done, because if you're using your phone, it might not work properly. Although, this tutorial has already been posted in my private Telegram group and the members are enjoying it. This is because it's super easy for me to post stuffs like this on my Telegram group quickly rather than having to make full video on it. Also, it's only on this Telegram group that you'll get to chat with me directly about any questions you've got to ask me. Therefore, if you're not in this group already, I'll drop a link to join in this video's description and also pin it in the comment section. So, first thing you need to do is to use the link I'll drop in this video description to visit Pixelverse dashboard link. It's going to bring you here. All you want to do is see this icon at the top that has this wallet icon? Click on it. And when you click on it and scroll down below, you see different wallets like MetaMask Wallet, Wallet Connect, Bybit, and OKX. Now, what you will have to do is choose Bybit. In case you don't have a Bybit wallet, I'll drop a link in this video description to register for Bybit to receive several bonuses. Once you choose Bybit, it going to load. Mind you, you've got to have to connect your Bybit wallet to your PixelTap Telegram app. Coming right here on Bybit, this is the Bybit Web3 wallet. It's telling me Bybit wallet is now live. Discover Web3. So, I have a Bybit Web3 wallet. I will skip this and then give you the option right here your gateway to Web3. Connect wallet, download the wallet, then use the Chrome extension. What you will do is either click the connect wallet right here or come to the top right here. Click on connect. Mind you, you might have to set up a Bybit Web3 account. You're gonna see mine right here at the top. You're gonna see my UID. I'm gonna click on connect. Guys, if you're enjoying this video, share this video with your Pixel Miner friends so they can get to do this very fast before Pixel gets to launch. If Pixel gets to launch today, which is 18th July at 12 o'clock UTC, you might receive your tokens from the 19th or 20. I'm not sure about it though, but just make sure you're on my Telegram group so I can keep you updated. So I'm gonna click on Connect Wallet. When I click on Connect Wallet, they give an option right here. You can see Connect Wallet, third-party wallet. They're going to tell you if you're using your PC, you will be able to easily connect any wallet right here. Your browser supports cloud storage with the seed phrase wallet. If you're using your Bit app and a lot of other stuff, what I will do right now if you are using your PC is to get the QR code right here. Click on Get QR Code, and it's going to generate a QR code for you, which is this right here. You're going to generate a QR code, scan it, and continue with the connection. If you don't want to follow that route, the one I suggest you get to do is click on the Bybit Wallet extension to easily connect to any dApp directly from your browser. I'm going to click on Download. Once I click on Download, it's going to load up. This is it right here. I've not added it to the Chrome extension. This is the Web3 Chrome extension. I'm going to click on Add to Chrome. When I add it to Chrome, it's going to tell me to add the Bybit wallet. It can read, change, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to say add extension. You're going to get it to load up. At the top right here, it has loaded. I'm going to go ahead and wait for it, then click on it. It's still loading at the top right here. It's done loading, and it has added right here. I will click on it. Once I come to this extension, click on it. What you do is come right here, pin it. 
You're pinning it because you want to make sure it is showing in your extension. The next thing you want to do is to come back right here once you've downloaded it. Click on it. Once you click on it, the next thing you have to do is to create a seed phrase. If you don't have one, I prefer you create a seed phrase to have access to this. If you have one, you can go ahead and import an existing wallet. If you click on the wallet again right now, which is what I'm going to do next, you will have to create a seed phrase. Even if you have an existing phrase, create a seed phrase for this particular account. I'm going to click on create seed phrase, then set a password for it. Make sure you enter a password you won't forget. That way, anytime you log on, you can access the seed phrase account. I'm going to enter a password. I'm done entering it. The next thing I do is click on, I agree and confirm. They're going to create a wallet for me. This is going to take a while. They're going to ask me to set it as a default wallet. I'm going to say explore now. Here is the wallet. I can go ahead and back up now. When you click on verify, you have to enter the password you used in setting up the account. When you enter the password, you will click on confirm. Scroll down below and then click on next. This is the password. I'm going to view the password and then go ahead and back it up. I'm going to enter the password the way they set it. They say phrase 4. I'm going to choose the phrase 4 for me. The phrase 4 is this right here. The phrase 5 for my account is that of this. My phrase 10 is this right here. Then I'll click on verify. Backup complete. I'll click on start using. This is it. What you want to do now is to have the account. This is the USD Ethereum. Next, we're going to do right here is go ahead and click on this. Once you're done with everything, all you want to do is maybe exit the website once you're done connecting it. Then go back to Pixelverse. Click on Bybit again. This time around, it will not automate because you already added everything. Right here, it's showing me the network is bad. The network is always giving issues. I'll click on connect wallet again. Before, this was showing us to download, but now it's not showing us to connect. I'll click on connect. Once I click on connect, it's going to load up. It's going to tell me grant permission will enable this tab to access your wallet balance and transaction history. Send transaction requests. No fund will leave your wallet without authorization. I'm going to say confirm. When I click on confirm, you're going to make sure the Ethereum is there. Switch to Ethereum. You're going to say connected. Boom. It's going to bring you to this wallet looking like this. Once you have your wallet looking like this, you have successfully connected your wallet to the Pixel dashboard. I'm going to exit this. Come back and you're going to see what it looks like. You're going to see the wallet. The wallet is an Ethereum wallet. Pixel is launching on the Ethereum blockchain. This is my wallet. Everything is now successful. I'm having zero dollars. If you follow this strategy, you will get the point to connect your wallet successfully on Pixel Verse dashboard. If you're having any issues, you can either use your phone to scan the core code, but using your PC will work perfectly. If you don't have AC, you will need to hire a PC to get this done. If you're watching this video, get to work and get this done before 12 o'clock p.m. UTC today. Though so I've already dropped this trick on my Telegram channel since, and my members are already enjoying it because it's much easier for me to quickly drop cheats and money-making stuffs on my Telegram channel rather than making a video to be posted here. And the thing is, it's only in this group that you'll get to chat with me personally and ask questions. So if you're not already in this Telegram group, you should hurry to with the link I'll provide in this video description and also pin in the comment section. With that being said, I need to let you guys know that it's not only hamster combat that can make us money. As a matter of fact, there are other more significant Telegram mining projects that are even better than hamster due to their heavy financial backing. So I'll drop a link to the top six of these Telegram projects that I think you guys shouldn't miss in this video's description and also pin it in the comment section. Therefore, please and please do not ignore any of those projects. Like and subscribe if you enjoy this.